Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and stay tuned by clicking the bell icon. Bridgerton Season 3's release plan makes Netflix's eight-season plan even harder to pull off. Netflix intends to continue its hit Regency drama Bridgerton for eight seasons, but its Season 3 release plan will make this difficult for the streamer to pull off. Based on Julia Quinn's best-selling books, Bridgerton explores love and scandal during the Regency period in London. Its anthology format allows the show to follow a new love story in every season, exploring each member of the Bridgerton family and their romantic exploits in depth. Bridgerton seasons 1 and 2 follow Daphne and Anthony, respectively, and Bridgerton season 3 will focus on a brother Colin. With Netflix hoping to turn Bridgerton into a long-running series, more members of the titular family will see their stories told on the small screen. However, even with a large Bridgerton family tree and an expansive cast of characters to focus on outside the family, Bridgerton's seemingly endless amount of material could prove a problem for the show in the long run. The pace of Bridgerton's release is similar to that of other Netflix's other shows, but with an eight-season plan, the streamer should be working to pump new seasons out faster. At this rate, Netflix is releasing a new season of Bridgerton about every two years. Optimistically, the time for future outings could be shrunk to around 18 months. Netflix hasn't even confirmed Bridgerton Season 3's release date, and it's been more than a year since Season 2 debuted on the streamer. At this rate, the final season of Bridgerton won't hit the small screen until 2034. Bridgerton Season 1 premiered at the end of 2020, and the second outing arrived in 2022. If Bridgerton continues to release a season every two years, the eighth and final season won't come out until 14 years after the show's debut. There are plenty of series that have held audiences' attention for over 14 years. However, many of those shows have at least one season that's running for the majority of the calendar year. The downfall of streaming and shorter seasons is that these shows have less time to impact viewers with longer waits between seasons. This could negatively affect Bridgerton, leaving viewers less interested as it continues. There are several potential issues with Bridgerton taking so much time off between seasons. The most pressing is that time doesn't just pass in the world of TV. Actors will age, and they'll potentially age out of the roles they're playing. Luckily, the youngest Bridgerton siblings were cast as children. They could still be the correct age when Bridgerton season 8 happens. However, this relies on all the actors to remain interested in their roles. Some actors have already left the show, including Rekha Jin Page and Feed Dynever, both of whom felt they'd grown out of their roles. Francesca was also recast because the actress wanted to be a lead in her own Netflix show. Another important factor is the attention span of audiences. While Bridgerton currently draws a huge viewership and has a devoted fan base, this may change if there's a decade-long wait for the final season. Viewers could lose interest as their favorite actors come and go, and storylines may get repetitive. As such, the show's ever-growing cast of characters and romantic plots might be Bridgerton's downfall in the long run. If you liked the video, don't forget to like, comment, and share.